What next for the participants? You would need to learn external debugging. So which means if you want to debug uh, from the portal screen or from Webdin Pro or from some third party application, you need to know how to debug using external debugging. Next, you might want to learn how to debug an RFC that is a remote function call. You also need to learn how to debug, uh, do the update debugging. If the function module is uh, update only, then probably you need to know when that will get triggered. Usually when there is a commit statement or commit in the application, those debuggers get triggered and you need to know exactly how to debug them. We, we talked something about the methods of the workflow, how to debug them. So in, in your self-study kitty, you need to put how to debug the workflow end to end. So you we are positive you can do that self-study yourself. And then we need to learn how to debug IDOC. If you are debugging an IDOC from WE19, you need to know the exact function module name and put the debugger, which is easy. If you are about to debug uh, IDOC for an outbound IDOC, so you might need to know that you need to use the program like rsnast00 and rseout00. Using those program, you can put your debugger in the exact place. So that way you can and debug your outbound IDOCs. So you need to learn that. You can self-study it. It is not a rocket science. You can do it by yourself. And if you are working in the new features of ABAP like OData, SAP UR5 and Fury, you need to learn to debug those. So those are new concepts and you, you we have sufficient material over the internet or in other portals. Just, just go through them. Um, with the concept which you have learned in, all, in this course, you should be able to easily grasp those those skills as well in case you find difficulties in learning these features like the external rfc update workflow idoc or the new uh, odata u5 and fury debugging do leave your feedback in the comment section if we get lots of requests probably we can create another course another video course which will help you learn these features once again we would like to thank you for going through this course we hope you had some takeaway points from this course which you can apply in your real projects. Please like us at Facebook, also follow us at Twitter and also subscribe to our YouTube channel. So all are same, easy to remember, it is SAP Yard. So please do 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 follow us, like us and tweet us. Thank you so much.